blesses me when I obey him. to them. So he got on a ship and sailed away from Nineveh instead of towards it. <laughs> While he was on the ship, there was a big storm. A big storm? And the men on the ship were scared. They asked Jonah to pray to ask the Lord to save them. Praying helps. Jonah knew the Lord sent the storm because he was running away from what the Lord asked him to do. Jonah wanted to save the ship, so he said if they threw him into the sea, the ship would be saved. They tried to row the ship to land, but the storm was too great. They finally threw Jonah into the sea. The storm stopped, but then Jonah was sm swallowed by a large fish. He was inside the belly of the fish for three days and three nights. During that time, Jonah prayed and repented. He wanted to do what was right and listen to the Lord. The Lord heard Jonah's prayers and made the fish spit Jonah out onto dry land. <laughs> Whoa, I've never heard anything like that. Jonah must have learned a good lesson or two. Yeah, a pretty amazing story, huh? Mm -hmm. The Lord told Jonah to preach to the people of Nineveh again, and this time Jonah obeyed. He went to Nineveh and he told the people to repent, or the Lord would destroy their city. And the king and his people repented. The Lord forgave them and did not destroy Nineveh. Nineveh is saved! Yeah! <laughs> yeah! So what can we learn from Jonah's story? We can learn that if we obey the Lord, then we will be blessed. Yes, and we can always make things right if we forget to do something. Yeah. So let's pick, pick up this park together. I'll help you. <laughs> okay. <laughs> this park looks so beautiful now. Yes, we did a great job. Thank you for helping. You're welcome, Mom. Pause the video and talk with your family about how you can obey the Lord to be blessed. Did you find the 
the heart of Jesus? It was right here. Thanks for watching.